U1 Lesson 8, Hymn to King's Document Analysis, Directions. Optional, if you want Ms. Core to read this assignment to you, click here. Intro, with the Ur Third Dynasty, which lasted from about 2112 to 2004 BCE, also appeared a new form of royal celebration in literacy form. The composition of hymns that sang the king's praises. His accomplishments were wide ranging, including especially skills in warfare, but also an athlete, a scholar, and a just ruler. The hymns connected to the king to the pantheon where the gods lived, claiming that the gods protected and promoted him and sometimes declared that he was related to mythical heroes of the path, such as Gilgamesh. The tablets and stories are most known for manuscript schoolboys wrote in the early second millennium when they formed an important part of scribal training. King Shulgiji of the Ur third period had the largest number of such hymns devoted to him, probably because of his long reign of 48 years. The extract here praises his skills as a student as well as a warrior using metaphoric language. Below is an excerpt written by an unknown schoolboy who is practicing his penmanship on a cuneiform tablet. The text is about King Shulji of Ur. Once you are done reading the text, answer the questions and the three main questions to analyze a historical document below the reading. Text, hymns to kings of the Ur Third Dynasty. I am king, offspring begotten by a king and born by a queen. I, Shulji, the noble, have been blessed with a favorable destiny right from the womb. When I was small, I was at the academy where I learned the scribal art from the tablets of Sumer and Akkad, which were two other city-states in the Middle East. None of the nobles could write on clay as I could. There were people who regularly went for tutelage, tutoring and education, in a scribal art. I qualified fully in subtraction, addition, reckoning, which is calculating, and accounting. The fair goddess Nanib Gal, who was the goddess of writing and grain, the goddess Nisaba, who was another goddess of writing, provided me amply with knowledge and comprehension. I am an experienced scribe who does not neglect a thing. When I sprang up, muscular as a cheetah, galloping like a thoroughbred donkey at full gallop. The favor of the god On, who is the king of the gods, brought me joy. To my delight, the god Enlil, who is the god of kingship, spoke favorably about me, and they gave me the scepter because of my righteousness. I placed my foot on the neck of the foreign lands. The fame of my weapons is established as far as the south, my victory is established in the highlands. When I set off for battle and strife to a place that the god Enlil has commanded me, I go ahead of the main body of my troops and I clear the terrain for my scouts. I have a positive passion for weapons. Not only do I carry lance and spear, I also know how to handle sling stones with a sling. The clay bullets, the treacherous pellets that I shoot fly around like a violent rainstorm. In my rage, I do not let them miss.